Hi everybody, it's Y2 Cool and we have an epic video to share with you guys and I want to say a special thanks to uh, Little Beauty of Little Guyana guys. You see this opening video that I'm going to share with you guys. It's a collaborative effort with Beauty of Little Guyana and Mr. Aditya Sanchara shot that little short piece of amazing video and I saw this video and I reached out to him and I told him how I felt about the video and the guy said, you know what, it's okay, I can use the video in my uh on my youtube so this is how i'm gonna use my video so i'm gonna shout out once more again um to beauty of guyana beauty of little guyana sorry by aditya sancha right guys cheers enjoy Put up. Everybody, it's very too cool, and we definitely. Um, we're going on a little uh, adventure, nothing too out of the way, not too fancy, just a drive about. Um, tomorrow is screenwriter, director, producer, um, 16 bar day. So, we're having the privilege of um, having a photo shoot done by a Mr. Photographer in the back seat there. Uh, that's her complimentary gift from him. So, if anybody wants to get their uh, the photo taken out by a professional photographer tell them what they can get you and what number or what platform 688-2779 there's my number on business page on Instagram Mohammed's Photography so guys you can uh, view Bunny Facebook in future and you can see some of the stuff that uh, he put out and you guys can judge and you can know if you want him to do stuff for you you just go to his uh, Instagram page or his Facebook page or reach out him by a, a phone number and he can do some um, amazing photography work for you guys so basically we're heading we're looking for somewhere nice to take out a few pictures we have to pick up a cake her birthday cake and at the same time we should grab some dinner hopefully we get something streetish because i want something street food kind of to eat nothing restaurant kind because um our type reasonably you know you buy brooks you know so you know, a quick fry plant on the roadside quickly for your birthday, your pre birthday. That's the place to be. So join us for this epic adventure, guys. Put up! So we're at Massey here, uh, blowing up her helium balloon. This is a nice little piece when you're uh, entering Massey. Uh, let me show you some of her amazing stuff that she have here. So it's a little gift shop you have here, right? And listen, can you tell our audience what the cost to blow that balloon up? $300. $300, guys. Three. That is an unbelievable price. If you want your balloon blown, helium balloon, $300 to blow it up as soon as you enter the Massey store in Providence, right? In Providence, guys. So with the Massey area here in uh, Providence, are we heading to a location? I don't know an unknown location. Not sure where we're gonna um, find a proper spot to take out her picture, but we must find somewhere. And my humble apology, um, when I mentioned $300 to do a, a, a helium balloon, I know it's too good to be true. Actually, it's not helium, it's regular 
uh, pump air CO2 I would think into the balloon right so helium are generally more expensive to do one of those balloons minimum is two thousand Ghana dollars so it's just regular air pumped into the balloon but it's gonna work it have to work this is beautiful Massey you guys uh, know this area uh, you have the new thriving restaurant upstairs you have the National Stadium close by you have Amazonia Mall next door you know so it's a happy place it's a happy spot so we're gonna check on Miss Bunny and see what's happening inside with her um, balloons and hope she's getting through so after our disappointment a few minutes ago uh, we're on the search for helium and we found a place in Echo as soon as you reach the stoplight or the traffic lights say you're coming from Georgetown it's gonna be on your left hand side uh, you reach the stoplight or the traffic light you turn left and you're coming to the store that sell oil on your right hand side there's a little store called partytopia i think they're online you can check them out so we're here looking for helium and they, they actually have helium for us they have balloons also and we're gonna see what's going on hopefully we get through and it's not a disappointment this time so we're in partytopia and you know it's a nice little pizza place they have some party supply and so on and we're we're having helium pumped into our balloon now this lady there she look happy now and she have an option of buying another set of balloon or another type of balloon yeah, so with adventure brings more adventure, eh? We found a new place. So that I think you got a um, rubbly bottle. Oh. Is that it's an L? It's I feel like it's floating. It's floating, man. Helium should float, I would think. Yeah, I'm no expert on helium. I'm sure. I got a hole. I got a hole somewhere. You got any uh, um, seven numbers? Put a piece of tape on the hole. <laughs> she <laughs> damaged your bag, girl. Yeah? Oh, Improvise on the balloon. If there's a hole, put a piece of tape on it. You tell me something right now. So I'm not going to intervene. This is a, a ladies' uh, moment. They are choosing what they want now and what color they want and what spec they want. I'm going to stay out of this, you know. I cannot put too much into it. We have these bubbles into it. Too fine. It's like a ball. Yeah, yeah. Which one? The black one. What is it you're putting in the balloon there? It's a high float. It's oh. Make sure because usually. Make sure it float. Yeah, the latex is usually just um, so for like a five or somewhere you put it in the glass like a eight. Nice. Woo hoo! <laughs> So in eventuality, this is what we end up with, her helium balloons. And somebody's gonna tell us a little bit more about their helium balloons, the prices and, and how people can make contact them. So if somebody want to uh, come and get helium balloons from you guys, what number they can get you on? Uh, is, give me a second. If you want a quotation, you want to make a call, you want a price, you can get them on this number. Go ahead. 625 7138. 625 7138. Okay. They're located in Echoes, guys. Call, take a quote. They have everything here, man. Right. Cheers. Thank you, guys. No problem. You're welcome. Thank you. You're welcome. So, when you, you come into Echoes, this is the sign you look, the yellow mine hydraulic sign. You come here and you query about the helium balloon, and you're going to get it right here, guys. All right? Easy, man. Easy access. Continuation of our photo shoot. We're at a uh, location, guys. We finally found a place. We've, we've been here before we fish. We are an old wharf in Diamond. I'm going to show you some of the surroundings and our crew, our photo crew. They got their balloons and things all geared up. Photo crew. I don't know where the, where the boss lady there. So, this is DDL basically in the background. This is the distillery area or the bottling plant area. They do vinegar, they do uh, Pepsi, they do all the fancy 12 year 5 year uh, 15 year 22 year 
all the years around. Basically, this is a sea dam area too. A lot of, I would think, squatting and so is going on here, but they have it very clean and tidy. It's looking really, really easy on the eye, eh? Or the girl. So how are you feeling, young? I feel like 16. 16? You, you want to around the 6 and the 1? It's a 6 and a 1 instead of 1 and a 6? I am so hungry guys. We have to go get something to eat. Again, I was hoping for something uh, road carnage. Some, some uh, grilled food or some barbecue pork or some barbecue chicken. But we don't know yet what we, ha what we are having. Hopefully we find something to eat. And we can conclude there uh, having dinner or whatever we want to call it. I'm going to call it lunch regardless of the time. Because I didn't have anything to eat for the day as yet. So basically we are at an old uh, abandoned wharf for this photo shoot. I hope that our photographer is uh, very knowledgeable with his work and we can see some Oh yeah, there's a sign that said you can pass and you can always <laughs> trespass as free as you like. Alright guys? If the guy shoot, don't know what happened. <laughs> so you gotta watch your step and be very careful, guys. Yeah, this looks really, really nice. Watch your guy, he's like going bush and tackle picture. Hmm. So our uh, photographer is going to be the first person to take a picture here professionally. Oh, Nobody nice. know where it's located. <laughs> so we're here finally on the old abandoned wharf. Um, it's very in uh, deplorable manner, condition, but it's all for fun, all right? So this is not in function. It's not in any use of, of, of that sort, but we're going to make use of it today. So the last time we came here, we had a little... Um, fishing trip also I don't know if some of you guys can recall but we were here once and we did a little fish you have to be very careful certain people having a hard time getting across short legs miss short legs and there in the background is the beautiful Demerara River very scenic eh so calm so peaceful Taking all that fresh air, buddy. Oh man, so good. It's so good here. Beautiful Demerara River, eh? Well, I'm gonna walk now. Are you freaking? So, what if the board I'm gonna shake? So, the photo shoot has begun, and Miss Lady is all teeth. So guys, you 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 got the guy information. If you want to get your shots done, not your flu shots or your COVID shots, but your photo shot shots. I'm I'm lo losing words now because I'm hungry. You can uh, reach out to Mr. Salim. Uh, he gave you his number early, and he gave you his uh, his platform that he's on, his Instagram or his Facebook, and so on. Alright, guys, and you can probably ask, and you will have to pay me for the location of this uh, beautiful place. And I can probably uh, release the hidden uh, location that we're using to some of you guys that I love a lot and that I trust a lot with it. So request, just ask. I'm going to give you the information, guys. Not to worry.
So basically guys, I'm balloon guy for today. I'm the guy who is responsible for holding all the balloons. So I'm balloon guy, all right? I'm gonna be balloon guy for the rest of the day. I'm gonna hold all these balloons. Hopefully I don't, you know, get uh, blown away. So there's a director, there's a photographer, and there's a model. Almost fall through the hole. So if if you fall in the in the mud, we're gonna also have pictures taken with her muddy skin. What is that about? Hmm? Roman said I'm take a picture with buy. She ate a thousand dollar wine. She said, I don't know who buy that for she. <laughs> Again, I'm gonna complain. I'm very hungry. I am hungry to max. And this photo shoot is taking forever. Look, you think it's a joke? More picture again, watch. So just a reminder, guy, it's her uh, birthday photo shoot. Her birthday is going to be tomorrow and um, we have a surprise for you guys. We're taking a birthday adventure. We're, we're going somewhere special just for you guys and for her sake too. We're doing a really, really nice little tour in Guyana and we're going to invite you guys along with us. You're going to learn some new stuff. I'm going to learn some new stuff too. So it's going to be a giant adventure between me and you guys. It's going to be really, really fun. More picture take out again. Hold on. Put one half on your waist and wine with your next waist. Oh no, you mean hold the wine? Can we get a little preview of what you're having there, Salim? Let's see yeah. what it looks like. Wait, wait. So this is one, guys. Can you you can skip and show us a, a, a couple more? So this is what our photo shoot is looking like thus far, guys. So this guy is an expert, and as you can see, all the pictures are looking really amazing. Plus, he have to fine tune them. It's not over yet. Yes, yeah, so you have to do a little bit of editing. So they're basically are waiting for this this beautiful center set so that they can use this background here because the sun is too bright for the picture so they are waiting so the wait sun to set a bit and this one is having a personal photo shoot there <laughs> another angle another picture and another um waiting time for my tummy my hungry little tummy so I'm praying for this to get over with so I can go grab something to eat. You guys must be uh, tired of me whining and, and talking about my belly, right? But I'm hungry, guys. And yes, it's a thing here in Guyana. It's a thing. Photo shoot, it's a thing. Birthday is a thing. Uh, people like, you know, doing stuff on the special day. Uh, they go for dinner. They, they, they take photos. They go on a uh, fancy uh, trips they you know they're doing everything like any any uh average human being so photo shoot is a thing here too in guyana you know we're, we're going places man and hopefully you know we're up to the times with uh, the rest of the world i have a really really nice piece of uh, video to show you guys at the starting you're gonna see it i should have not mentioned it so we're gonna let them finish up here i mean we all already saw most of it what a photo shoot basically is and we're gonna let them do them thing and we're gonna leave in a few and we're gonna continue our epic adventure guys all right so we're gonna check in back in a few but up we're gonna join the photo shoot maybe i'm needed to for a, a few pictures and so on so i'm gonna uh, check in back just now after our epic uh, photo shoot, we uh, drift away in the diamond housing scheme area. We are at a place called Player Sports Bar. Okay, we are at Player Sports Bar. This is in the 17th Avenue. So this is a nice getaway, guys. We are in the diamond area. You just uh, road 
come into the 17th Avenue and there you will see the sign come down to the end, Play Sports Bar. And we were invited here briefly by a good friend of ours to come have a quick suki suki here. So we're going to show you guys what inside look like. Uh, the place is very nice. It's very cozy. Very uh, relaxing. I can tell you that much. Plus, for entertainment, there's a pool table. So photographers here, body girls here, boss ladies here. I'm going to have a cold suki suki. And they're having a board day moment, a, a picture conference here right now. So I'm gonna have a cold board day drink here. Guys, thank you for having me. Cheers, board day girl. So this is the owner of the establishment, guys. So she welcomes you guys to her uh, place. She has a really nice the bar too, you guys can see. The bar is there. And cheers, suki suki time. Drink banks and give thanks. So finally guys, uh, remember we told you we're gonna pick up the cake after the photo shoot. We didn't even get to lunch or dinner as yet guys. So here's the cake, have a look. So it's a bunny cake for a bunny, yeah? So this cake uh, cost us what, 7,500 inclusive of delivery. So they had to deliver it for us too, a thousand dollar extra for delivery. So originally it's 6,500 dollars for this cake. It's a unique cake and it suits the body girl. So this is the cake guys, so we're gonna head out now for dinner. I am so hungry. I keep stressing on this and we're not getting to our uh, dinner location or our lunch location. So we're heading for dinner, all right? One last look at the cake. Elena, you want to taste the cake? She want to taste. Hi guys. So after all the whining and all the complaining after picking up the cake, the brief photo shoot, we are here for dinner, finally. So we're having authentic Chinese food. Uh, you guys will probably know this already. This is one of my favorite places to eat my Chinese food. New driving on the main street. Uh, we're here with Miss Christine, the same girl with the teeth all the ocean mouth. That's Christine. The photographer still here with us. She's having dinner. Birthday girl is here too. She's having dinner. And we're all really, really hungry. So we're gonna conclude having our uh, dinner. Basic stuff, basic uh, Chinese fried rice. Uh, we're having uh, deep fried chicken and roast chicken and some local steamed veggies so you guys are gonna have a brief preview of our dinner i'm gonna have a few bites with you guys and then we're gonna fun food all right You know, I think you got a government Wi-Fi, you know. Yeah, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. You're supposed to pick up the free Wi-Fi. Beautiful Main Street on a Friday afternoon. Oh my God. <laughs> Waiting on the food, but we suki here. So we're taking a suki chair, so you're 16 more day. 16? Sweet 16. <laughs> But do you guys spend the six and the one and put it six to one? Six to one. So it's coming bits and pieces. So when we eat from your drive in, we do special request garlic sauce and ginger sauce. So we just complement this with our fried rice. You see, it's really, really good. So we got empty plates still. And we have our sauces on standby. So we're awaiting our food now. Suki Suki Galore. About 10 minutes of waiting and no food, guys. I'm waiting, I'm waiting, I'm hungry. Recently, you know, it's a, a week weekend, so, you know, everybody come out to eat, so we gotta wait our turn. Kitchen busy. But I'm really, really hungry. What was the question, babe? What? You asked me a question just now. What was it? I don't know. That you wanna give me 2,000 US dollar? Hey, don't put your mind for me 2,000 US dollars. You got 2,000 US dollars? For me 200 US dollars. So, after the long wait, finally food is here. Nom, 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 nom. So we're having some um, local veggie, uh, roast chicken, deep fried chicken, and a platter of fried rice. Take me my guard on next fried rice, you know, buddy. That's a large, by chance? That is a lot. You can do it. Don't look so. 
We are a large. Yes. Can you check back with them for me, please? We are a large. Okay. We'll take the large and the medium. The medium and the house, right? <laughs> that would be one of that's a large? No, that's a medium. The large is coming. Yeah, that was saying. They can wait on the large. I can't wait. I can't wait. I'm hungry. I'm no sorry. lunch, guys. Like Hello. This roast chicken from the tribe in the bed. Sorry, can I eat the lettuce? Nice. Oh, goodbye. Hungry, babe. Good stuff. Good stuff, guys. Must try, right? Try the um, fried chicken. That's the fried chicken. Yeah. That's what you're saying. Please get chicken. And you want to show me the fried chicken? Suki, suki. Good stuff, good stuff. So we're gonna wait and see what happens if they're gonna extra fry rice. Right? Or if you get to keep the medium. And we get a complimentary large. We're hoping for the best. I'm gonna keep you guys posted what's happening here. There's a huge deliberation here now about the fried rice business. Hopefully we get a large on the house. Let's see how it goes. We'll take off for the kids and some man. Who, who knows? Who knows? Finally, my meal is here. I'm having uh, roast chicken, fried chicken, local uh, steam, our local fried rice, tomato, cucumber, pepper, everything else. So I'm gonna dig in. I'm so hungry, guys. Wait, wait, I'm not finished, you guys. I'm gonna raise the front and warm it up. Mmm, here we go. Deep fried chicken, some kind of sauce. This in here. <laughs> I like the, mm. the sweetness of this. This is so good. This is it. This. So, in conclusion, I want to thank you guys for joining us today. It was very epic. It was very real. It was uncut. It was unedited, and we had a fun time. Hope you guys are having a fun time too. Thank you guys for watching. Join us for another episode. Little guy and my two cool and family. Hold up.